How's everyone doing? Good, I hope, you know. I love Robocop, you know. I do. Like, Robocop is my favourite movie, you know, of all time. And uh, the first movie is, is my favourite, you know. Um, it was iconic, it was brilliant, like, you know. So, you know, uh, like, uh, this is the uh, 3 zero, sorry, the um, Play Art Robocop. And it's awesome, you know. Uh, I really love it. Uh, it comes with different hands, and uh, I have them with the with the um, with the needle. You know, he he sticks it into the computer. He gets the information about you know, Clarence Balaker and everybody else, and the gun holder. Robocop is just an iconic in my opinion. Uh, I love it. You know, and um, great stuff. Head to one nine. Of course, is awesome. You know, you know. You have 20 seconds to comply, you know. So, it was iconic. So, we got the television series, you know, because we love Robocop, you know. Um, uh, it's over 16 hours on six discs, you know. And uh, Now, to be honest with you, we haven't watched this in a long time. So, we forget all the episodes. I'm going to have to watch it again, you know. But, um... When I heard about this, I had to get it, you know, um, because all of Robocop, you know, so you're getting over sixteen hours on cystic see, uh, uh, twenty one episodes, right? So, um, you know, so what we do remember is that it's not great, you know, what I mean, it, it's it's just not great, um, for one reason, there's no Peter Waller, right? Peter Waller was Robocop. And they got a different guy to do Robocop in this one, you know. Uh, if I forget his name, like I ha we have to watch this again, you know. Uh, but it's it's not great. I mean, uh, in my opinion, uh, the acting is bad. Um, uh, cause, cause Peter Weller had the voice down and the movement of a robot, where this guy just walks around as as a tough guy. He's a lot shorter than, than Peter Weller, the guy that they play, that the, the guy that plays Robocop in this. He's a lot shorter, so he doesn't have that presence league that you'd expect him to have, in, in my opinion. That's what I, I remember, you know, that he's just not Robocop, the guy that, that they chose to do the television series, you know. Mm. Um, it's just not Robocop, uh, unfortunately. But it's not terrible, I say that, but it's not great either, you know. Now, I'm being generous there because I'm a massive Robocop fan, you know, so... Now, another problem with the television series is that there's no Ed 209, uh, which is unfortunate. You'd think it'd have one or more episodes with Ed 209, but there's no Ed 209. Uh, so that's disappointing also, you know. Uh, but like I said, I haven't watched this in a long time, so uh, we can't tell it in specific because I'm, I'm going to have to watch them again. But we know that the guy that they got the plays Robocop. It, it, it's not Peter Weller. It's somebody else. He's just not as tall. He's not as imposing. And he doesn't walk around like a robot like, like Peter Weller done. Now, that's my opinion. That, that, that's what we remember. And there's no Ed uh, 209. So, and they, there's no like, standout villain, if you know what I mean. Because it's a television series. They have to stretch it out over 21 episodes. Um, but, but one of the episodes I do remember, right? Uh, there's a Robocop and then there's a, a Robocop all in black. And this guy is a black police officer. He, he's meant to be his partner or something like that. And they team up or something like that. That's what we remember about this specific episode. That's the only one we remember where there's two of them. There's no Robocop and there's a black Robocop. And a black Robocop is black. He's like his partner or something like that. So we don't know. Um, so that's, that's all we, we can remember um, about it. Um, uh, it's pretty cheap. We got we got it pretty cheap because I guess no one wants to watch it. You know what I mean? Uh, so you know, um, it is what it is. It's um, you know, so there you go. It, it comes with three um, uh, three DVD boxes with a disc in each one. You know, um, so. You know, um, somebody put it, the future of law enforcement, prime suspect. 
troubling Delta City, you know. What money can't buy and stuff. So, it, and it's 12s also, so it's not as violent as, as the movie. So it's very low key because it's a television series. Um, so, the. It is what it is. Um, now, this is. Now, when it comes to movies being made into television series, the. the, the Apart from Robocop, Terminator is the only other movie that was made into a television series. Into a television series, now, I have no idea what that's like, but uh, I'm not gonna say it's that good either, you know. But the um, so that's what the, the, the discs look like, you know. Like I said, I'm, I'm gonna have to watch these again because I haven't watched them in a long time. Uh, but I just wanna make a quick a quick video about that. Um. Robocop the television series. Um, we got it because I'm a massive Robocop fan. Um, and it's not terrible. It's we're being generous there, you know. Uh, if if people watch the movie, like, uh, and then watch this, they're gonna be disappointed because it's just not the same, you know. Uh, but it's it, it, it's it's like watching a, a police drama on television, except it has Robocop in it. And look, like I said the guy that they got to, to play Robocop just is a Robocop, in my opinion. To me, it's just a fella walk around like a, like a tough guy, like a cop. And he's, look, like I said he's not as tall as Peter Weller. He doesn't have the same imposing threat. And the suit, it, it looks like it's a rubber suit, like you know. To be honest with you, it doesn't look like he's a cyborg. But that, that's that's my opinion. That's what I, I, I remember about him. And um another thing that we, we, we remember about, about uh Lewis isn't his partner in this, it's someone called Madigan and she's a female police officer as well. So they have to they had to put in new characters. It, it can't be just Lewis and and Reed and stuff like that. They had to have more characters, so you know. But it's just not good, um in my opinion, from what I remember, but it's not terrible, you know. And uh, this is the complete series, 21 episodes, so it went on for a while, like, you know, um, but, uh, yeah, um, so that's, that's Robocop, the television series, like, um, would I recommend it? Only if you're a diehard Robocop fan like me, then yes, I would say, yeah, but if you're not, then pass on it, because it's just, won't, won't be of any interest to you, you know what I mean, I'm just being honest with you, uh, but it is what it is, uh, you know, um, uh, if, if you want something to watch, then yeah, watch it, but you're going to be uh, bored with it, to be honest with you, you know what I mean, because the come to class, it's been sort of ridiculous, in my opinion, <laughs> if you want to watch a cop drama, then Watch a real cop drama, in my opinion, if, if you're into cop dramas. Uh, you know, um, uh, yeah, so let's put these back in. Jesus, uh, we haven't touched these in a long time, so we're getting them back in the fucking box is tough. I don't want to wreck the box. So that was we saw. Yeah, so in my opinion, passing it. Yeah, but if you want something to watch, yeah, I, I, I say some people would, would would probably get a laugh out of this because of just how ridiculous it is. Um, e even the actors are trying to hold back their laughter in the episodes, which is so, sort of funny. But uh, yeah, I mean, you will get some enjoyment out of it, you know. But if you're gonna like, if you're a serious sort of person. And if you're going to compare this to the movie in every single way, then you're going to be disappointed. Now, to be honest with you, I was, you know, but I also saw the humour and how bad it was, like, but that's me, like, you know. Um, um, now, if I wasn't a Robocop fan, I wouldn't watch this, and I probably wouldn't know that it existed, because it's hard to find, like, you know. So, yeah, I mean, that's, that's, I just want to make a quick video about Robocop, the television series, you know. I will. I am gonna watch them again. Um, uh, but what I do remember is it's not great. 
Um, the main problem is the guy that they cast as Robocop in the television series. Look, I said, it's not Peter Weller. Or it's not your man Borg from Robocop 3. It's somebody else. And he's not as tall. And he, it's just not good enough, you know. So they, they had to get a 6 foot far, 6 foot 5 tall guy. But they didn't do that, you know. So that's a problem, you know. And all these new characters and stuff just don't really care, like, you know. There's no Ed 209, there's no Kane, you know? there's, no, there's no Robocop 2. And the effects aren't really that good, like, you know. Uh, so <laughs> that's what I, I, I remember. I'm just being honest with you. Um, uh, but it's not terrible, like I said. Um, I mean, we've got a few laughs out of it, but for the wrong reasons. It's not meant to be a comedy, but it comes across as being ridiculous, you know. Um, that's what I remember, you know. It could be, it could be wrong in saying that because I, I am gonna have to rewatch this, you know. Cause I haven't watched it in a long time. But uh, yeah, uh, that's that's why we got the television series. Um, I, I, I could recommend it, um, but uh, it's it's not terrible. It's it's not terrible. I'm, I'm being generous there, I guess, you know. But if, if someone out there actually loves the television series, great, I mean, fair play, I mean, once you enjoy it, you enjoy it, you know. It is what it is. It's a television series. Yeah, uh, but if, like, we kept comparing this to the movies because that's where I got the television series, like, like, like most Robocop fans, because they, cu- they were curious to see just how this would turn out, you know. And in my opinion, it just turned out shit, you know. And, uh, yeah. Unfortunately, but you know, um, it is what it is, and we all love Robocop, like I said, it's the play arts Robocop, um, and it's fully articulated and everything else, and like Ed, Ed 209 is just iconic, but you know, Ed 209 isn't in the order, you know, so that's a, a problem, you know, yeah, so that's it, so I'm, I just want to make a quick a quick video about that Robocop the television the television series on DVD you know 16 arrows on 60 so yeah you know someone out there might actually love this and if they do great yeah but in my opinion what, what I remember about it is it's just nothing special okay uh, so yes yeah, um, thanks very much for watching and uh, I'll see you all later uh, take care bye bye